Hey guys, this is Frozen34, and this is another Marvel Contest of Champions video. This video is about the Alliance War Season 10 and basically getting a new map and new nodes, but not getting new rewards. Let's take a quick look at the new map. Um, this is the, the higher tier map. There is another map for the lower tier, but I, um, most people that I'm assuming are, are in this map right here. Uh, like myself and uh, it is much much simpler to do with your alliance and then then we have the new nodes there is a lot of new nodes all right so this is just a quick run through them right here but we're going to come back in a moment and talk about them uh, there is a link in the description if you want to go check all this out on the kabam forums for yourself uh, and look at everything look at the both different maps look at all the nodes look at where all the nodes are going to be like where where's this is and where that is so yeah you can go click in the description and click on that and go look but let's talk about rewards real quick and uh, what, what what's going on so uh, basically we have here uh, backstory time and they're, they're basically talking about defensive tactics saying that they're, they're they want to add this other feature uh, coming later on not right now but like next season possibly uh, as you can see right there it says that it is scheduled for season 11 but that could mean it could get pushed back all right maybe even possibly come out early but uh, I'm, I'm assuming uh, d could get pushed back more than anything um, which that allows you is to apply global buff alliance gets to choose the leadership does and so every alliance would be a little bit different and and then so your alliance may have i don't know what the buffs are going to be but let's just say maybe 300 percent health boost and then maybe another one's 300 percent attack boost or whatever whatever they might be we don't know yet and so your alliance may have this one your alliance you're facing might have a different one you may have the same one it just depends on what everybody chooses we don't know what those nodes are going to be yet but let's look at see when um what they say about uh, defensive tactics uh with rewards basically saying defensive tactics uh it's currently scheduled for season 11 and that's when rewards were going to come out if you read the paragraph in the first picture you saw that that they're they're not going to come out their new rewards won't come out until defensive tactics is released which is currently scheduled for season 11 which is very disappointing uh to me myself and i'm sure many 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 all of you as well but uh, it's that sucks uh we we're getting all these new things and no new rewards for it so as you can see here again uh they're saying that is the the re new rewards will come out when defensive tactics is released and we're not getting that until possibly season 11 maybe even later so now let's take a look at these nodes and like what they are and where they're going to be and i got guys i want you to remember that these nodes are going to be paired with certain characters that already may have abilities that be paired up with these that make them even stronger and they may be all over the map in different places uh, who knows how many of these are going to be on there uh, except you can go look at the full list of where the nodes are on which 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 actual node node but these are the new buffs for the new nodes uh, and everything so you got inverted immunity bleed which is the attacker receives a bleed debuff every x seconds dealing zero damage if this debuff is removed or prevented from activating the attacker instead loses y percent of their health instantly and then you got quick nullify regen whenever the attacker gains a regen buff it is nullified after x seconds then you got buff toggle unstoppable every x seconds the defender gains an unstoppable buff for y seconds then you got buff toggle unblockable uh, it's pretty much the same thing and then let's uh scroll down here we have uh, boost buff armor up the defender armor up uh, buff gains x plus x duration and ability actually when struck with a critical hit the defender will remove one armor up buff to reduce damage to zero and then you got psychic thorns when the defender is struck with a physical contact the attacker takes x percent of the defender's attack as direct damage striking the defender with non-contact attack heals the attacker for y percent of the damage dealt the, then you got power focus one the defender gains at plus x uh power rate while below one bar of power but suffers 
minus y power rate we have power focus two the defender gains plus x percent power rate while below two power bars of power but suffers a minus y power rate while above then we have the best defense the defender gains plus x evade and auto block accuracy ability accuracy triggering evade or auto block grants the defenders y percent of a bar of power then we have greater confusion the attacker suffers from inverted controls throughout the fight can then we have confusion the attacker suffers from reverse controls for the first x seconds of the fight then we have agus intercept uh, basically they're indestructible charges intercepting uh, uh take removes one of those charges and you have agus heavy which does the same thing but you remove it with heavy attack so guys those are the new nodes and you've seen the new map which i'm going to put up on the screen again right here and so you've seen the new nodes you've seen the new map there's going to be some of the old nodes you can go, again you can go in the link in the description below you can go check that out you can go look at everything and see where everything's going to be uh for the bosses and everything so guys remember you're going to be pairing this with champions that are super hard to fight right now you're gonna you're gonna have new whole new experience in war with all this stuff and then then you're not going to be getting any new rewards because they want to wait uh till they release this other uh defensive tactics uh later on which is not maybe not even coming out in season 11 but hopefully it does hopefully we get the new rewards then and everything but uh, it's just it's really disappointing to get all all of this like we wanted an update to alliance war for a long time now uh, we're getting it we're getting new maps we're getting new nodes new abilities uh all kinds of new stuff right this is what we wanted we we wanted this um the alliance war is my favorite game mode but it's not fun if the rewards don't match what you're having to put out and put up with and that's exactly what's happening here um we're getting all the stuff that we want but we're not we're not really getting we're not getting anything for we're getting the same rewards that we used to get and then and then dealing with all these new nodes and everything but hey, the map is going to be a lot simpler uh it's going to make everybody work together more on mini bosses and stuff uh you won't be by yourself basically for routes and then if you have a hard time you might be able to switch out to another route and then someone can else can move in because there's so many choke points in this but guys if you like this video hit the like button subscribe to the channel if you're new and i'll see you guys next time peace out